All right, so we're in the part two. It came in our gift from Netherlands. Puzzle erasers, and it was already out. It's all in different language. How cool. And this one came out in 2016, I believe. Full pack. Get all this together. So these are erasers puzzle. And you won't believe this. Check this out. So I looked it up online. For one, it's two sixty-nine for one. This guy's asking for a Leonardo, which is right there. He wants it for ten seventy-three free shipping. Watch this. Where is it? For the full mysterious pack, it's twenty-four ninety-nine. Wow, that's a lot. And then for a full pack again, ten dollars. I mean, people are really asking a lot for this. And just for a pack, it's like three bucks. <sighs> so, I'm gonna go ahead and get these guys out. I'm downloading the part one, or uploading part one. So this is part two. Put Raffi out right there. Let's put out Raffi. And... I think it is, yeah. So we're gonna Raff. So you could take them apart and everything. And switch them. Look at that. So just one leg. Or uh, not two legs. Back on this is real. Yes, this is a real deal. So this whole thing is a eraser. How weird. But I'm not gonna use this as a eraser. I wanna keep this from a collection. But that is so cool. So trying to do this with one hand. Maybe I can't. What could I use? This is not easy. Okay, take out the shell. Voila. There you go. Even align with the hole. It's like their belt all over again. Got that. And then I'm going to put his arm on. And the arm's kind of loose. So I guess let's put it up like that. <laughs> Too bad for a racer. Guarantee this part comes off. That is actually pretty cool. There you go, Michelangelo. Got the colors right. Come on, get in there. Really? There we go. Got my 
Galangelo right here with no nunchucks. So if you're at the Swami or the collectible store and you see these nunchucks, just remember it's from the Eraser Ninja Turtles. I had gone. Not much of a win for nunchucks. Okay. Uh, Hello. A little bow staff. Easy to break, so be careful with that. Okay. He has long arms. Looks like he got chewed up. So one hand, let's find out. Guess I can. Or not. Hang on, let's put this down. I no idea where my tripod is at. It kind of like made his hand a little bit weird. I don't think it's supposed to have gonna hold very well. Yeah, I think I messed up on that. Because it doesn't really hold the bolt staff at all. Yeah. If they cut out a little bit more of the gap of his hand. Yeah, that, that bolt staff isn't gonna stick. So you can do it. So yeah, look at that thing. They did not do a good job on that, but the arc is coming off though. Three dollars for this. Ten bucks for that. That's insane. So don't tell it doesn't hold his bow stuff very well. <clears throat> we got Leonardo with his little sword. Can't put the sword in his sword holder. Actually, he can hold his sword pretty well. See, if we have that little gap right there, that's perfect. So everything comes off. The legs come together, but it rip them from here. Take out the front shell. The back shell is attached. Arms and sword comes off. Head comes off. Which I wasn't meaning to do that. The mask. Actually, I think the mask comes off. Yeah, it does. Okay. Comes off too. Looks like Leonard's more handy than the rest of them. Well, Leo goes good, Raphael's okay, Mikey's okay, and Donatello just does not work well with this dinky little bow staff, and the arm comes off. So, it is pretty weird that knowing that people are actually selling this for $30 each in a little baggie, and then some people are selling it for like $10. I don't know what you guys think. I know those people out there have these. And these are the year version. And I know people are asking for a lot for these things. I remember when they first came out, people were selling them for 10 bucks. I remember that when they first came out. But they're not worth 10 bucks, I could tell you that. And they're 
but they're pretty cool. I like these though. Super awesome. I love them. So, put your comments down. Tell me what you guys think about this one. Puzzle eraser. And this is so cool. Not suitable children for under three. Now that's how they're supposed to hold it like that. Silver had her eyes are all gooky and poofy. <sighs> Alright, so put your comments down, tell me what you guys think about these toys. Yay or nay for ten dollars. <laughs> but luckily I got this for free and like I said so many times. Thank you for the gift. We got a lot more to go. So this is considered as part two. Not bootlegged. Um, I never see these here in, in America. I just know that people are saying they're selling them for like 10 bucks for ch in China and Japan or whatever. So, $10, huh? Put your comments down and tell me what you guys think. Uh, hope you like this review. Mm. And if you do own these, are the guys look a little bit weirder than yours? Let's hear your thoughts behind this. Alright guys, until then, take care of yourself and happy hunting everybody. See you later.